I'm Sean Levy, the director of All the Light We Cannot See. Today I'm going to watch the climactic scene where Werner runs the rampart of Sam Elo on his way to save Marie's life. And we're going to break down the sequence shot by shot. The first thing you have to know about this sequence is that you never know where and how inspiration is going to strike. This sequence was not in the script. I went to Sam Elo in France to scout a location. And when I first stood on this rampart wall, I was like, oh, damn, no, we got to do something here. So I literally started making stuff up with my iPhone and my crew acting very badly. So he's already stopped. He sees an explosion, time's running out, and then he starts running, and then we run together. I knew that I needed Werner running from A to B with explosions all around. But I confess, I think in my mind, it was more just running. And it was my assistant director, uh, whose nickname is Zulu. Zulu comes to me in prep and he goes, uh, hey, Sean, um, you know, I think you're going to be underwhelmed if he's just running on a naked wall. Can I just pepper in some German soldiers? Because if the town is being bombed, they would definitely be mounting defense positions. And I was like, yeah, yeah, whatever. Um, that sounds cool. Yeah, sure, make something happen. I'm picturing, okay, so maybe there'll be like two German soldiers who cross the path of Werner. I show up, Zulu has dialed in like 40 Hungarian extras who are playing those Nazi soldiers in those defensive positions, bodies being carried on stretchers, guns that I don't even know. Look at this, like none of this was planned. When I watch this sequence now, I know that it wouldn't be half this compelling if it was the way I pictured it. And so we, we always, as filmmakers, I think, count on, hope for collaborators who make our work better. <laughs> Pulling off the run itself was complicated. Weeks and weeks of storyboards. Storyboards are then converted into previs, uh, which allows you to see how these shot ideas that I had would feel in motion. And then we had to basically, because we're not gonna literally bomb Sam Elo, so we built a rampart wall in Budapest. No stunt double there. That's Lewis Hoffman doing the run himself, and those are real explosions. Obviously, some are augmented. The city that's crumbling in the background of Lewis, those are digital environments based on historical photography from the 30s and 40s of Sam Elo. But really, that's the goal, right? That visual effects is working to augment and to enhance practical effects and real performances by actors. When you're directing a sequence like this, it's really challenging. And it's not just challenging because it's complicated, but you are juggling like 90 coexisting thoughts and feelings. So on the one hand, you're like, yeah, run for your life, set off those explosions, go, go, go. But you also are conscious that you're replicating a historical events. And above all, you must keep people safe. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Love doing the job, love talking about the job. Be sure to check out All the Light We Cannot See, only on Netflix.